Detroit Auto Show kicks off today, and it kicks off with plenty to celebrate in the auto industry. U.S. car makers coming off their best year since 2007. Sales up 8%, over 15 million vehicles. And ABC's Rebecca Jarvis sat down with the new chief at GM, its first female CEO. GM's new Mary CEO. Mary Barra stepping onto the world stage, making her first appearance since being named the first female CEO of General Motors. Congratulations. Thank Good Morning much. America getting Thank exclusive you, access. Oh, yeah. Behind the scenes at the Detroit Auto Show, even this riding around Cadillac town CTS? with Barra okay, in one of GM's hottest new, new cars, movie. the Cadillac CTS. When you were originally told you're going to be the CEO of General Motors, was there a conversation with the family about okay, things are going to change. Just sitting at the, at the dinner table and, you know, shared with uh, the kids that uh, I had been selected for this role, and, and they were very excited. Barra, voted most likely to succeed in high school, fell in love with cars thanks to her cousin's Camaro. I was like, that is the coolest car. <laughs> but I had to make the smart choice to be able to afford college, so I, I had a Chevrolet Chevette. Her father, a GM worker for 39 years. Her mother, a bookkeeper, who encouraged Barra to pursue math and science. It was her mantra, you're going to go to college, you decide what you want to be, but you're going to college. In 1980, Barra's first job at GM, inspecting Pontiacs coming off the assembly line. Gaining trust, she quickly moved up the ranks in the historically male-dominated industry. I didn't think no. oh, I could be the CEO of this company someday. I stayed focused on the job I was doing. I, I, I that, you know, that, you're, that's you're, the Are trick. you serious? I'm serious. And I think sometimes, uh, you know, in industry, people are too focused on the next job as opposed to their job, the job they're really doing. And that's been my focus. But for all the gender talk, Barra would much rather focus on the car. I've never approached it from that perspective. I've just, you know, go in, work hard, do what needs to be done, build a strong team. What does it say to the American auto industry and the American people to see a woman on top? When I started here 33 years ago, I had no idea this is this is the role I would be playing, but I approached every position like I was going to do it for the rest of my life. So I think that's a very strong message about hard work pays off. Barra's predictions for the future, more electric cars. She says gasoline's still going to be around in 25 years. And guess what else will be on the roads? Self-driving cars. And she feels okay about that, George. <laughs> and you look okay behind the wheel. Thank you, yeah. Rebecca.